The National Military Academy Afghanistan is touted as the crown jewel of higher education in the country. With a curriculum modeled after the U.S. Military Academy at West Point, the cadets get a first-class education with help from West Point and U.S. Air Force Academy mentors. Admissions are tough. 600 new cadets, for example, were selected from a pool of more than 3,000 qualified candidates. The competition to gain admissions here at NEMA is very, very uh, competitive, uh, very similar to the way it is at West Point and the Air Force Academy. Engineer officers Shah Noor and Shafiq Haibat recently completed a six-month internship with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, Afghanistan Engineer District North. During their time with the Corps, they learned all aspects of engineering management, quality assurance, and hands-on training with sophisticated engineering software. I will be happy to uh, train or teach um, engineering cadets, and this is going to be the good things for me in the future, to have a good cadets or students and engineering site. As engineer officers in the Afghanistan National Army, they're responsible for all aspects of civil engineering within the ANA and various government projects. With their newly gained knowledge from the internship, their focus is on helping with the reconstruction of their country and maintaining stability. As you know, it's different than the, to be as an uh, infantry officer or to be as an artillery officer. It's different to be an engineer and also an officer at the same time. Reconstruction of Afghanistan will be a big priority for the engineer officers. They say they're committed to the challenge and will use all they've learned from the internship with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. Hank Husingfeld, Kabul, Afghanistan.